What rules or superstitions do you swear by when fishing? G'day all, Paz here, back after another hectic few weeks. Seems like life is conspiring to keep me dry at the moment, and eking out a session has proven very difficult. Even worse, the flathead season has well and truly started, and I haven't been a part of it. At least, until an opportunity presented itself in the form of a catch-up near Point Walter, giving me a chance to put one of my ironclad fishing rules into effect. When at Point Walter, always have a cast from the jetty. My next snapshot, chuck a line in off the Point Walter jetty and see if my rule holds true. This will be a short vid, because it was a short session. While I love walking the flats for the Bartail Lizard, a busy work and family schedule hasn't allowed me the time or freedom to do so. It's the same old story, and it's proving frustrating that I haven't been able to fish or film as much as I'd like. Still, never say die. I found myself with a couple of hours free to catch up with Uncle Matt at Point Walter. Of course, a fishing rod just happened to find its way into my car. After a coffee and a chat, we headed out to the jetty so I could chuck in a line. Now, we anglers can be a superstitious lot. Beyond the usual fishing rules and regulations that we all have to follow, I'm sure every angler has a few of their own rules and superstitions that they follow. It could be using a certain lure at a certain time, or having a lucky hat or gloves. They may sound silly to others, but for whatever reason, they hold true to us, and we swear by them. One of mine is to always have a cast of the Point Walter jetty when I'm there. Always. This rule has served me well over the years, and last season especially, when I really got into flathead fishing. It's been responsible for a few of my better fish. This time, however, I was sceptical. The wind had picked up and the tide was howling past the jetty. I found my cast for about 10 minutes or so, getting nothing. That was fine, as I was just happy to be out there fishing and enjoying the company. However, I can't deny, a fish would be nice. Well, I'd given up. Hadn't gotten anything, and it seemed like I'd need a new rule to follow. At least, that's what I thought. Bait junky plastic was slammed, not five metres from the jetty. Here's two. Let's walk him in. Literally, yeah. I do love it how it ends up being right next to the jetty that I catch the damn thing. My first flathead of the season. At 37 centimetres, it wasn't a massive one, but any fish is a good fish in my current climate. Under the watchful eye of Uncle Matt and his kid, it swam away strongly. Of 
Good to know, my point Walter rule still holds true. Always have a cast of the jetty. Snapshot complete. I'd love to hear about any weird and wonderful fishing rules or superstitions you may have. Let me know in the comments below. Sorry about the short video, but I was so excited to actually get out on the water, I couldn't wait. Thanks for watching. As always, this video is dedicated to my two sons. This is Paz, wishing you fair winds and tight lines. Until next time.